Welcome to the video demo of Big Monitoring Fabric VMware NSX Monitoring by Big Switch Networks. We will briefly talk about the requirements for monitoring VMs in NSX overlay network environment, challenges with traditional virtual monitoring solutions with regards to agent deployment and related operational complexities. We'll then show how Big Mon NSX integration solves the monitoring challenges with an agentless and automated provisioning approach using VMware APIs before jumping into a demonstration. Let's briefly talk about the requirements for virtual monitoring. How do I monitor inter-host traffic between two VMs on NSX overlay network? Or inter-host VM traffic residing on NSX logical switch where packet flows never leave the host? Also, monitoring a VM if the VM migrates from one host to another host via vMotion. Traditional approach to monitoring in virtual environment has been to deploy agents. Challenges to agent-based approach are Deploying and managing agents on every host can lead to operational issues. User has to first determine which host to install the agent on, and then manage those VM agents via proprietary management system. Deploying an agent on the ESXi host consumes compute resources, in which case one has to plan and allocate various resources for the agent such as CPU, memory, and storage. Another challenge with agent-based approach is that agent has to be version compatible with VMware deployments. Also, what happens when a VM migrates to another host where agent is not installed? We lose visibility to that VM. Now, an overview of Big Switch offering for NSX monitoring. Big Monitoring Fabric NSX integration provides a single and simplified workflow for selecting VMs which are on NSX logical switch to be monitored via Big Mon controller. NSX and other VMware network configurations are automated to relieve the network or VM admins from performing this task. No intrusive VM or agents are installed on the production server. There are two deployment modes a user can select from, Option 1, Span, and Option 2, ER Span. With Option 1, Span-based monitoring, a port mirror session has to be configured in VMware with dedicated server uplink. This is recommended for continuous VM monitoring. With option 2, ER span based monitoring, user can dynamically select the VM they want to monitor without the need of a dedicated uplink. We leverage built in port mirroring and ER span features provided via NSX API and other VMware APIs to tunnel traffic from selected VMs. In this demo, we will utilize ER span option for dynamic VM monitoring. Let's see how Big Mon NSX integration enables visibility in the virtual environment. Once the user has entered VMware account credentials, BigMon controller will pull the inventory for entire vCenter, thus enabling visibility into all the VMs managed by the vCenter. Now let's see how this is accomplished on the BigMon controller UI. Navigating to the integration menu, we select VMware vCenter and register it with BigMon controller. Likewise, we register NSX manager with BigMon controller. Going to BigMon vCenter page, we get a summary of what has been discovered by the controller, like inventory and configuration details, thus giving user centralized single pane of glass management. Host inventory consists of all the hosts that are managed by the vCenter. For each host, we can see the host IP, which ESXi version each host is running on, CPU and memory usage. Virtual machine stable gives us information about all the VMs being managed by the vCenter. This table gives us information such as VM name, power status, and ESXi host the VM is deployed on. After the inventory is populated, user selects which VMs to monitor from the BigMon controller. Once the user has selected the VM to be monitored, BigMon controller programs the ER span session via VMware API. The ER span tunnel is then terminated on the BigMon fabric. Now we will go back to BigMon vCenter integration page and select a VM for monitoring. We can see that the selected VM is now being monitored. ES Pan Tunnel is automatically created by BigMon controller via VMware API. Going back to vCenter, we see that a port mirror has been created. Source and destination for ES Pan has been populated. Once the VM has been selected, the user can then create the appropriate monitoring policy. Since BigMon controller keeps track of the inventory, a VM migrating to another host with vMotion can still be monitored. Before creating a policy, let's start a ping between two VMs which are on NSX logical switch. As you can see, here is the ping request and reply on the VM. 
Now let's create a policy to monitor this traffic and send it to our Wireshark tool. We give policy a name, demo, append the desired rule to the policy. For this policy, we will send all the traffic to the tool. So we select any as a rule. Then we select the vCenter to which the NSX manager is registered to. And finally, we select the Wireshark tool and save the policy. Now that the policy has been created, ER span traffic is now being forwarded to the Wireshark tool. BigMon NSX integration provides agentless VM monitoring which avoids deployment and operational complexities associated with traditional agent-based solutions. Automation leveraging built-in VMware APIs to provide end-to-end -end network traffic visibility in virtual environment. Integrated single pane of glass for NSX monitoring. Flexible and on-demand NSX VM monitoring for intra-host traffic or intra-host traffic or monitoring VM when a VM migrates to another host via vMotion. To try the hands-on lab with the Big Monitoring Fabric, please visit us at labs.bigswitch.com. Thank you for watching.